Hello everyone, myself Dr. Srinivasaya from the Department of Collegiate Education, Government of Karnataka. In this class, let us try to understand on the topic of Asian Development Bank, that is ADB, its objectives and structure. This topic is Mangalore University, third semester BA in the subject of Monetary Economics. Learning objective of this session is to understand by the learners on the concept of Asian Development Bank, the objectives and introductory part of Asian Development Bank will be understand by the learners after completion of this topic. Session outcome is to help students to understand what is ADB help students to understand how ADB come into force, that is came into force and what is their objectives, helps the students to understand objectives and organizational structure of ADB, these are the session outcomes. My presentation plan content is like this, introduction of ADB origin of ADB, meaning of ADB, objectives of ADB, members and management of ADB. This is the session plan. In the introductory part, when we understand Asian Development Bank is a regional development bank which is established on 19th December 1966. The Asian Development Bank, it is established on 19th December 1966. The company also maintains 37 field officers around the world to promote socio-economic development in Asia. Asian development main objective is to develop and promote socio-economic development in the Asia specific region. The headquarters of Asian Development Bank is located Manila, Philippines. President of the Asian Development Bank, Asakawa. The type, it is a multilateral development bank. Total members of this bank is 68 countries. Main organ, Board of Governors, which means functioning body functioning body of the Asian Development Bank is Board of Governors. This is the introductory part of Asian Development Bank, that is Asian Development Bank, which is established on 19th December 1966. It, is, it has maintained 31 field officers around the world to promote socio-economic development in the region. Okay, so these are the content which is being covered in the introduction. Further, meaning of the Asian Development Bank. The Asian Development Bank is a multilateral development bank whose mission is to foster economic growth and cooperation is one of the poorest region of the world, which means poorest region Asian, Asian specific. For this Asia specific reason, how, what are the development strategies to be adopted so, these development strategies will be developed by the ADB in promotion of, in promotion of international cooperation and economic growth. Motto of ADB, ADB is committed to achieving a prosperous, which means like a, a kind of a richfulness, inclusive, which means bringing all uh, developments together, resilient and sustainable Asia and the specific, specific while sustaining its efforts to eradicate extreme poverty, which means Asian Development Bank is going to fight against poverty in all its member countries. In turn, it is going to bring cooperation and to, uh, and to bring resulted in the economic growth. That is the main, uh, main meaning, the important meaning of this ADB. Asian Development Bank. Further, 
objectives of adb the important objective of the adb is as name it goes it helps member countries in countering poverty poverty is one of the challenging issue in the asian continent so therefore it is going to help its member countries to counter poverty help the countries towards economic growth for its member countries it is going to give financial assistance for the economic growth to support human development hrd development issues also hrd development issues will also be funded by the asian development bank they believe in preserving and protecting the environment so asian development bank believes and preserving protecting the environment and which means to say that environment will also to be protected with the help of this adb they works towards empowering women improving their status in society so these are the important objectives of adb which has been set further membership and management of adb from 31 members as it's established in 1966 it is grown to the extent of 68 members which means in the year it has established with 31 members now it has gone to the 68 members out of which 49 are from within asia and specific 19 from the outside outsiders in the year 1966 india joined this institution this is the membership pattern membership nature of asian development bank management of adb the structure of adb consists board of governors board of directors president vice president and staff which means staff vice president president board of directors and board of governors this is the organization functioning management of adb management of adb board of governors so it is the main organ of the adb which means the board of governors are the important working organ of adb early member country appoints every sorry every member country appoints one governor for participating in meeting of board of governors every member it is going to appoint its governor and to formulate the general policies of adb so these board of governors they also formulate the general policies of adb the board of governors elect president vice president and board of directors this a uh, board of governors will also appoint like this for that management of adb in the board of directors to carry out day to day activities of adb task sorry take decision concerning policies of the bank guarantees investment technical assistance by the bank 12 directors of adb board of directors is elected by the board of governors eight from within asia and specific four from the others elected from the outside the region so this is the board of directors of adb further management of adb president how it is how he will be elected elected by board of governors chairperson of the board of directors top most official of adb and he manages the entire business of adb he or she is responsible for the organization and management of adb president is present president is asakawa japan is one of the largest shareholder of this bank ja largest shareholder of this bank therefore president of the adb always is japanese vice president the president heads a management team comprising six vice president the team surprises the work of adb 
operations administrative and knowledge department so this is the function man a function of the vice president resources of adb which means how financial resources have been pulled from the different countries resource of adb is built up by the subscription of member countries adb offers loan grants and technical assistance from specific special funds trust funds and other resources to help resource poverty sorry to reduce poverty in asia's poorest countries adb's financial capacity to well over usd us dollar 200 billion by 2020 which means the total financial capacity of adb is by 2020 is usd 200 billion dollars on 31st december 2018 japan us holds the largest proportion of shares that is 15.5% china owns 6.4% India owns 6.3 percent and Australia owns 5.7 percent of total resource of ADB. So in that specifically, India owns 6.3 percent of its total resource of ADB. Conclusion: To say ADB play a very important role in the. global economic development in facilitating asia and specific reason by the eradication of poverty in its member countries by granting loan to its member as a result we can say that adb play a very very significant role for its member country to eradicate poverty so the references which have been made this also you can go through that further so that is member countries that all which has been covered in 68 so that is uh, further so that's how where all of you are required to be keep in mind who holds the presidential post of adb currently so that is asakawa so that is how where you are required to be keep in mind further where is the adb headquarters are located manila philippines so that's how where you are required to be keep in mind when the adb is established so that is 19 december 1966 that's how where all of you are required to be keep in mind which is the main organ of adb board of governors which i have already mentioned which have all you are required to be keep in mind this is how the information all of you are required to be keep in mind for your information